by the colonel movies that pop himself um, definitely go check out his channel he's one of the most inventive movie review channels I've seen uh, he's a must-watch um, movie review service for me he's fucking amazing go check him out movies that pop um, really awesome so let's just get into this right now uh, I have some VHS's to kind of hold them nine 12 monkeys one of my favorite movies of all time 28 Days Later with the Fox Connect slipcover. That's awesome. Uh, About Time. This is like one of my favorite romances ever, and it has a slipcover on it, and I'm super happy. Um, Air Force One, a great Wolfgang Peterson film. Afflicted. This is a really underrated film that I don't see a lot of people talk about. Ugh. Missed out. All Superheroes Must Die. There are a few uh, DVDs sprinkled in throughout. The American... Alien with the Fox Connect slipcover, got that going on. American History X, American Ultra, American Hustle, sorry, American Ultra. Oh, it's uh, backwards. This first shelf is not doing well. Anchorman uh, one and two deluxe edition steelbook. Argo, a very Harold and Kumar Christmas signed by Kumar, so that's pretty cool. Uh, the Babadook. Bad Lieutenant, my favorite movie probably ever. That movie's amazing. Bad Lieutenant 2 or the remake with Nick Cage. It's a good movie, but it, I don't know what it has to do with Bad Lieutenant. Bangkok Dangerous, one of my favorite action films the last few years. Batman Returns Steelbook. I'm looking at getting the rest of them. Before We Go, one of my favorite movies of last year. Chris, Chris Evans is a great director. Blood Runs Cold. It's a great uh, Swedish film. And Big Game, starring Samuel L. Jackson. Before Sunrise and Before Sunset, those are not released on Blu-ray, surprisingly yet. But Before Midnight is, so I would just hope they, they put those out on Blu-ray at some point. The Big Short, Billy Talent, Scandalous Travelers. This is a documentary about a punk band. Uh, Billy Talent, check them out. Black Swan, Birdman. Body of Lies, like, this is probably in my top five uh, Ridley Scott films. Bond Cop, Bad Cop, this is a movie that no one's fucking heard of. This is the Bones Brigade uh, skate set. Um, I'm not going to pull it out because it's kind of heavy, but it's fine. Bangkok, Dan ba ah, Bangkok Dangerous. Boondock Saints Blu-ray, uh, this is a really standard edition. I need to get the um, one with the, I think there's a steel book out right now by Zavi. Boulevard, Robin Williams' last movie. Okay, The Bourne Identity with the slipcover. The Bourne Supremacy. This is my favorite Bourne film. The Bourne Ultimatum. And a movie that we're not going to talk about. Boyhood, Braveheart Steelbook, and The Bridge on the River Kwai. Brokeback Mountain, one of my favorite romance films. Buffalo 66, this is Vincent Gallo's uh, directorial debut. I think it might have been Christina Ricci's uh, screen debut as well, but I love this film. Like, I love this movie. It's one of my favorites. Uh, Bunraku, haven't seen this one. Uh, it was a gift. Christine, my favorite John Carpenter film. Burnt. 
I can't show this because it's Cannibal Holocaust. Camp Blood 1 and 2 in 3D. Captain Phillips. The Captive, one of my favorite movies from 2014. Chasing Amy, probably my favorite movie of all time. Chopping Mall on DVD because there is no Blu-ray yet, but I know Scream Factory is putting out one soon. Chris Hardwork Mandroid, it's just a thing I got at a thrift store for a few bucks, so it's no big deal. Uh, City of Angels, I love this romance film starring Nicolas Cage. I'm a little biased. Clerks. Clerks 2. I can't wait for Clerks 3, by the way. Cloverfield. Cold Comes the Night, I love this movie. Colin. Commando Director's Cut Steelbook, I'm really proud to own that. Con Air. Collateral Damage, a really underrated Schwarzenegger film. The Counselor. Shit. Movie. And Cowboys and Aliens with the slipcover. This is the extended edition. Cymbeline. The Dallas Buyers Club. Dark Blue. I love this movie written by David Ayer. The Dark Knight Rises. Deadpool. Dead Girl. Death Spa. Uncut. Death Valley. Uncut. Deja Vu, one of my favorite Tony Scott films. It's one of his last, actually. It's pretty sad. Disconnect. The Dirty Harry Collection. This is one of my favorite sets ever. Dirty Harry is one of my favorite movies. District 9. Django Unchained Steelbook. Dollman. The Doors. Donnie Darko and S. Darko set. And then the uh, Donnie Darko Director's Cut. Doubt. Drive. The Drop, Dying of the Light, and this Edward Scissorhands box set. The End of the Tour, my favorite film last year. Enemy, The Equalizer, can't wait for The Magnificent Seven, but that shit's rated PG-13, I don't get it. Escape from Tomorrow, Blu-ray, Everything Must Go, my favorite Will Ferrell film. Ex Machina, without the slipcover, I know, blasphemy. Uh, the Exorcist Complete Collection, Extraction, a really good Stephen C. Miller film, The Evil Dead NC-17 Steelbook, I love this movie, Face Off, oh, Faint Four Stick, I know, I know, The Fifth Element Steelbook, Project Pop Art, of course, The Flash, Complete First Season, Flight, Foxcatcher, Frankenstein's Army, The French Connection, Friday 13th, 1 through 8, uh, 9 through 12, no, 9 through 11, and then The Front Line, Full Metal Jacket, one of my favorites, Fury, Galaxy Quest, the best Star Trek movie ever made. And Generation Kill on Blu-ray. No, it's on DVD. Actually, this is. I need to get the Blu-ray set of this because it's a Great War series from HBO. Get the Gringo. Ghost Rider One. Ghost Rider Spirit of Vengeance Steelbook still wrapped. Ghost Rider Spirit of Vengeance Blu-ray. The Gift. Gladiator Sapphire series. Godzilla. Goon, Gone in 60 Seconds, Gone Girl, oh it slipped, The Grand Budapest Hotel, this still holds up, I just watched it the other night, Gremlins, The Green Inferno, The Grey, Guardians of the Galaxy, Hangman, this is a really good movie that I uh, recommend people watch. Harold and Kumar set. I just took it out of that one up there. Hatchet, the R-rated edition. The Hateful Eight. Heathers. Her. Hercules. And Hitman Agent 47. The Hobbit, an unexpected journey Target exclusive. The Best Buy exclusive unexpected journey steelbook. 
the Battle of the Five Armies 3D, the extended edition of An Unexpected Journey, the Desolation of Smaug, and Five Armies. Hollow Man 1 and 2, Home Alone 1 and 2, The Complete Indiana Jones Adventures, Ang Lee's Hulk, Edward Norton's The Incredible Hulk, The Hunter, Hypothermia, Immortals, The Ides of March, The Informant, Inglorious Bastards, my favorite Quentin Tarantino movie. This is my favorite Steven Soderbergh film. It's also my favorite film of 2009. I, it's one of my favorites. It Could Happen to You. Jack Ryan Shadow Recruit. I really like this movie. Um, I don't know why people didn't really go to see it. Jersey Boys. Joe. John Wick. The Judge. I watched this movie when I was a kid, um, directed by Doug Lyman, who directed The Born Identity and Edge of Tomorrow, or Lived I Repeat. Um, it's a fine movie. I need to watch it again. I got it because I used to watch that when I was a kid a lot. Jurassic Park comic book steelbook is really fucking cool cover. Really cool looking. All, it's really cool looking. Kick-Ass without the slip cover. Kill Bill Volume 2. Kill Bill Volume 1. Killer Elite, Killing Them Softly, Steelbook, Kingsman the Circuit Service, The Secret Service, I can't wait for the Golden Circle, The King's Speech, two very different English films by Colin there, um, yeah, Kiss Kiss Bang Bang, Knowing, The Last Days on Mars, The Last Stand, with Arnie, it's one of my favorite movies of 2013, with the slipcover, by the way. Leaving Las Vegas. I'm a Nick Cage completist, and I am an atheist. And I own this movie. That is why. Legion. The Lego movie. The special, special edition. Leon the Professional Pop Art Steelbook. Only at Best Buy, I'm pretty sure. I know the fifth element was. Leprechaun, the complete movie collection. Lone Survivor. Looper. Lord of the Rings. Lord of War. The Lords of Salem. Lost in the Sun. And Lucy. <laughs> Mad Max Fury Road 3D. Maggie. Man of Steel, The Man from Nowhere, please go watch this movie, The Man from Uncle, Maniac, please go watch that movie, Man on Fire, one of, this is probably one of my favorite movies of all time, definitely in my top 10, The Man with No Name Trilogy, The Martian 3D, I need to pick up the extended cut of this, I know it just came out Tuesday, The Matrix Digibook, The Matrix Trilogy, Metallica Through the Never, MI5, Minor Threat at the DC Space Buff Hall and 930 Club, Mississippi Grind, Moneyball, Monsters, Monty Python and the Holy Grail, The Muppet Movie, the original classic, My Bloody Valentine and its remake, Natural Born, Kill ah, Natural Born Killers Digibook, Next, The Next Three Days this is one of my favorite movies of 2010, and Nick and Nora's Infinite Playlist. It's an infinitely long movie that I hate, because it doesn't fucking end, it's infinite. Nightbreed, the Director's Cut Limited Edition, um, my number was 1,910, I'm sorry, trying to get it to focus there, out of 10,000. Nightcrawler, Night Moves, Ninja Apocalypse, I know, 
No Country for Old Men. Motherfucker! Non-stop. Not suitable for children. The November Man with the slip cover. I like that movie. One hour photo. Outcast. Pain and Gain. Partisan. Pay the Ghost. Pet Cemetery. No! Pink Floyd the Wall, come back! Pink Floyd the Wall. Platoon. Porkies. Phantom of the Paradise, one of my favorite movies of all time. Primal Fear. This has an even better twist than Fight Club, in my opinion. Prometheus. The Punisher. Purple Rain. The Pyramid. Rambo, the best in the series, in my opinion. Rampart. Raising Arizona. With the Fox Connect slipcover. And Rage. Reasonable Doubt. Redemption, a great Stephen Knight movie. Repo Man, I love that film. Requiem for a Dream. Reservoir Dogs, Mondo Steelbook. Rise of the Planet of the Apes. I actually prefer Rise of the Planet of the Apes over Dawn of the Planet of the Apes. But I am in the minority on that one. Robin Hood, Director's Cut. Ridley Scott film. Rocky. This movie's kind of rapey, if you know what I'm talking about. Roger Waters' The Wall. Run All Night. This is my favorite movie of last year besides End of the Tour. Nicolas Cage and The Runner. Saving Private Ryan Steelbook. Sabotage. I love that David Ayer film. Um, if you watch the alternate ending of this, it fucking rocks. Safe House, this movie is amazing. Savages, one of my favorite Oliver Stone movies. Scooby-Doo, grew up with that. Scott Pilgrim vs. the Word, Steelberg. Steelberg. Season of the Witch with the slipcover. Secret Life, Walter Mitty. Seven. See, he See No Evil, Hear No Evil. Selfless, I like this film a lot. Shaun of the Dead. She's Out of My League. Short Term 12, Sicario, Silent House with the slipcover, Silent Night, Deadly Night, Slapshot, Snitch with the slipcover, Snowpiercer, Source Code, Southpaw, Canadian slipcover edition, and this is the Best Buy exclusive steelbook, Space Cop, Red Letter Media's Space Cop, Spider-Man Trilogy, Starship Troopers Trilogy, Star Trek The Original Motion Picture Collection, so all six of them, Rathacon Director's Cut of Star Trek The Rathacon, Star Trek The Next Generation Motion Picture Collection, all four of them, the remake, and the sequel to the remake that's fucking shit, Static, I hate Star Trek Into Darkness, because it's not Star Trek. It's fucking Star Wars. I'm sorry, but I hate that movie. Stitches. Stolen. Straight Outta Compton. Super Hybrid. SWAT. Tales from the Crypt. Death Lives. And Taken with that Fox Connect slipcover, one of my favorite movies of all time. Taken 2. And Taken 3. I actually really like the series. <laughs> Taking a Felon 1, 2, 3. The Terminator. Texas Chainsaw Massacre. The 40th Anniversary Collector's Edition of Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Texas Chainsaw Massacre 2. That Awkward Moment. The Theory of Everything. The Town Steelbook. This is the Director's Cut. Training Day. Train Spotting. Can't Wait for Porno. Which is the sequel. It's coming out. January 2017. Transporter refueled with the slipcover. This is really hard to find. Trespass. Trick or Treat. Trouble with the Curve. True Romance. Tusk. Unknown. Love that movie. Under the Bed. Stephen C. Miller movie. Up in the Air. And Vehicle 19. Okay, final stretch, guys. V for Vendetta. Victor Frankenstein. Wait Until Dark. 
A Walk Among the Tombstones, like that movie. Warm Bodies, I like that movie. Watchmen, I like that movie. The Director's Cut and Ultimate Edition is in that one. Wind Talkers, Where the Wild Things Are. I might like this movie more than her, but that's just me. Wolf Cop, The Wolf Man Remake, I actually like that one. Whip Lash, The Wraith, two copies of it, one sealed, one not. Wrong Turn 6. Now, you might be asking yourself, Kane, why the fuck do you have Wrong Turn 6 sealed from Best Buy without even a slipcover or anything? Well, that's because this movie was recalled, and this, I'm not going to open it, never going to watch it, but this movie was recalled, and my local Best Buy still had them. So I was like, fuck it, I'm going to buy it. And I looked up why it was recalled before, and apparently the director of this movie decided it would be a good idea to put real missing persons posters in the movie as missing posters in the movie. What the fuck? So, yeah, I have this, and it's sealed, and I'm never going to open it, but it's pretty cool. The Astonishing X-Men. X-Men. X2. X-Men The Last Stand. X-Men Origins Shit Shitterine. X-Men First Class, X-Men Days of Future Shit, I mean, Days of Future Past, I actually like that movie, I'm just joking. Zombievers, Zombie, and Zombie Night, starring Anthony Michael Hall, Daryl Hannah, from the director of Piranha 3 Double D, why do I own this unrated version from the Asylum? show you guys what I have up here. Um, this is an IMAX 3D collectible ticket for Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 2, and this is a Batman v Superman cup. This is the Halloween 15 disc complete collection, um, deluxe edition. This is a Batman v Superman mask, and it's over the Dark Knight trilogy. I don't have the big box set, but I do want it. Uh, Fight Club, the Fox Connect slipcover, and if you take this off, it's the Nakatomi Plaza Die Hard collection. Um, it's fucking beautiful. And in here, in here, if you go in, there is all the Die Hard movies. All four of them. That's right, all four of the Die Hard movies. Four! There's only four. X-Men Apocalypse Popcorn Bucket, that's pretty cool, I like that. Harold and Kumar, lighter edition. Hellboy the Golden Army, little statue with that, and another Batman v Superman cup. I have Apocalypse Now, Redux, and the theatrical cut, the King Kong Steelbook, Mad Max, this is one of my favorite movies, uh, Predator 3D, Predator 2 with the Fox Connect slipcover, that's really hard to find, Mad Max, the same one as that one, but the Best Buy exclusive Steelbook, uh, Robocop Best Buy exclusive Metal Pack, and this is a 28 Days Later thing, just a DVD of it. Uh, Dread, without the slipcover though, so I'm kind of sad on that. And The Beyond, I love this movie, Lucio Fulci. Uh, Deadpool IMF collectible ticket and a different collectible ticket for the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. And over here are some Friday 13th, uh, shoes that I won't show you with. And that's a sand person. Well, yeah, I hope you guys like this and, um, uh, have a nice day. Goodbye. <laughs>